Hi everyone, I am back with a Primark haul today. Um, excuse the setting, we're in our my parent-in-law's um, conservatory, which is our kind of bedroom when we're away, um, when we're visiting for Christmas. Um, it sounds horrible being in conservatory, but it's actually very nice. And there's blinds on all the windows, so it's not like we're kind of exposed. Um, but yeah, we've got like stuff everywhere and there's not much room, so I'm kind of wedged in between the girls' beds and our bed. So I'm going to try my best to do like the best haul I can. So I went to Primark um, two days ago with my sister-in-law, um, the one in Bletchley, which is quite a big big Primark and it was heaving. So um, I didn't buy that much, but I got a few bits and um, a few extra Christmas presents. So I thought I would just get a few things. So I thought I'd show you what I got. First thing I'm going to show you, actually I might wait till the end because Tom's probably watching this. Um, okay, if Tom, if you're watching this, can you skip forward about 40 seconds? I'll skip forward. Okay, go. So, I got this nice top slash jumper for Tom, um, which is kind of, I don't really know what colour you'd call it, it's like a washed out brown kind of colour. Um, but it's quite a nice sort of cottony, um, sort of thin jumper top with raglan shoulders. Um, but it's quite nice, it feels like nice and just easy to wear, not too kind of clumpy. And that was £12, so that's one of his extra Christmas presents. I'm going to hang that on the um, clothes area that the camera is on. I bought myself a nice mirror, which is only £3 because it's handy to have a decent mirror when I'm away to do my makeup because I'm either looking in a massive tall mirror or trying to look in the tiny mirror that is attached to my um, blusher. But this was £3 and it stands up by itself and it's just like a shiny pink thing. Very nice you might think until I discovered when I got home that I've cracked it. Um, I'm going to drop it in a minute. So yeah, got a nice little crack in the corner. There it is, in that corner. Already. So, um, I'm going to get seven years bad luck or something, am I? Am I? I don't know. Anyway, it'll still be quite handy, I can still use it. Um, I got two of these um, handbag tidies, which were three pounds. It was in the home homeware section, um, and they are just like pink, kind of nylony thing. It's like a it opens out. And you can put it inside your handbag to kind of organise little things like little I don't know hand gel, creams, lipsticks, anything really. But I thought um, not for me, but I thought it'd be handy for the girls to have in the car because it's got like um, two handles on it so it's got a handle on the back um, and I thought they could be attached to like the back of our headrests in the car so they when they're in the car and they've got all their like little toys they bring on journeys and, and little notebooks and pens and stuff they could put them in these things to kind of keep them tidy and not just dropping them on the floor in the car. I've got two of those. They might not work but they'll be handy for something in the house if not. Um, two, ooh, start to around. two packs of flannels, three flannels in each pack, which were three pounds. So I've got dark grey and there's another pack somewhere, I'll show you later. There's the other handbag tidy. I thought I'd try some of Primark's makeup. So I got some. Well, I wanted to get some 
Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation, um, which is the next thing I was going to buy, like after Christmas in the sales or something. Um, I hadn't got around to it yet, but I saw this in Primark, which, if you haven't seen Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation, it looks exactly like this in a little glass bottle. I don't know if that's focusing. Probably not focusing, never mind. Um, I can't remember how much it was. Oh, five pounds. Um, it's on their My Perfect colour range. And this is ivory. There's only, I think, three sort of whiter skin colours to choose from. Um, so I kind of just guessed that might be ivory. Um, it seems like it should be. Okay, so it's long wear, ultimate matte foundation, double coverage. Don't really know what that means, but it sounds good. So I'll try that and see if it's any good. I got a nice kind of wintry autumnal nail varnish in vintage rose, which was 90p, I think. Yeah, it's called vintage rose, but I thought it'd be quite nice for Christmas day. Some of this, which is a stocking filler, which is a bit of a joke really, but it's um, anti-stress spray. So I thought when me and Tom get really stressed with the kids, I can just like keep this on me and just spray his face or something. And it might work. Probably won't work. So, next. Next two things aren't on their hangers, because I've already worn them. Um, I've got this jumper which is like a kind of coppery, bronzy sort of colour, like tan, what would you call it? Um, it's quite a thin jumper with like sort of ribbed edge sleeves. Um, I think that was eight pounds. Um, and it's really comfy, it's really nice to wear. It comes down nice and long at the back, which is good when you're in a wheelchair. So you're not showing off your builder's bum. And with that jumper, I wore these skinny jeans, which hopefully aren't too grubby from yesterday. It can take me about an hour to hold them up. Anyway, high waisted skinny jeans. Super high waist. Um, yeah, they're like slightly stretchy as well, and they're really comfy. So I'd recommend them. They were nine pounds. And Primark now do some of their jeans in, in three lengths. So I think they are the 32, 32 inch leg. Um, Cause you can also get 34 and 30. Um, so my mum actually might be able to shop in Primark for trousers one of these days. She's like five foot 11. I got this, which is not something I would ever normally pick but it's a skirt and it's kind of black with stripey, sort of sparkly stripes. And it was reduced to five pounds. And I just thought, it's not something I'm gonna wear every day, obviously, but I thought it might be nice for like New Year's Eve, um, just like a long sleeve black top. But yeah, it was reduced to five pounds. I thought I'd give it a go and if I don't like it, I can always give it to a friend or something. Obligatory pans from Primark, because why not? The next bit of makeup I bought was. I was now making faces at me through the window. <laughs> what a knob. Um, an eyebrow pencil, a double ended like eyebrow pencil and brush on the end. Um, I'm always losing mine. I currently can't find my one with the brush, so that was a pound. Got this little cute pink shiny hairbrush, which was 150, which is a stocking filler or a little present for Tom's mum. Um, she likes her little, little mini brushes to keep in a handbag. I'm so excited about this. It is a makeup tidy organizer thing. And it's kind of pink shiny on the outside. It's a beauty organizer. 
if I can organise my beauty. It's just three pounds, but it's just like a clear kind of perspex um, thing, which has like different size pots for bits of makeup and stuff. It's, I find it quite difficult to to get my makeup out of a makeup bag. Um, and for my Christmas present, I've got like a vanity case that opens out like a clear thing with sort of tears in it. So I'm keeping all my makeup in that, but that'll be handy to have like other little bits. I got a plain vest just because they're really handy to have for layering and things. This was £3.50 and it's kind of a dusty rose kind of colour with like wider straps because <clears throat> I've got some of the spaghetti strap ones and they're quite good but I prefer thick strap ones. I've got about two of those. Where's the other one gone? That's where I picked up a grey one. I can't find it. The other three face cloths, face cloths, which are like a kind of corally pink colour. Um, but yeah, all our panels at home are all kind of, they once were white and now they're grey and all sorts of other colours. <coughs> and they've been bleached and oil washed and I think they've just gone beyond help. So I thought I'd buy some more panels and not white so they kind of don't go discoloured as much. And the last thing I got was a pair of pyjamas in this nice like gift box thing. They're like Disney pyjamas, like a top and trousers. Um, these are reduced to £7. Um, these are for my sister-in-law. managed to buy them while she was there and just didn't notice. Um, so yeah, it's like a, an annual thing, we buy her new pyjamas. So it wouldn't be Christmas if we didn't buy her some pyjamas. So yeah, those are the pyjamas I've got her. And they come in a nice little like, box which opens out. So you can sort of see them inside. I'll take off the reduced sticker. And I think that is it because I can't find the other vest top. I don't know where it's gone. <coughs> but yeah, that's about it. Just a few little things. Um, I hope you like this video, this little Primark haul, pre-Christmas Primark haul. Um, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next one, hopefully in a more tidy setting. See you soon, bye!